repair these roads, when you repair areas and bridges, people can have more pride in their neighborhoods, but it's also a safety issue when you're working with infrastructure in the bridges, in the 35W bridge that crashed. You know, we need to repair what we have, maintain it. It's all vital for Minnesota. When people use the term infrastructure, what, what they have to kind of look at is themselves. It's the inside, it's their bones, it's their structure. Infrastructure are our sewers, our streets, our foundations, our bridges. When you talk about uh, employment opportunities, uh, as we've said the last you know, five years, I mean, our industry has, uh, uh, has experienced uh, unemployment that hasn't been seen probably since the Great Depression. Unemployment and, and the lack of jobs, it affected me, my husband, our family. Um, you know, there were some very hard trying times when you don't have employment, you don't have insurance for your kids. Bonding bills maintains, infrastructure builds on it. Types of projects that we'll see are those needed repairs and improvements at the University of Minnesota. But a significant uh, amount of the bonding bill uh, goes to Minsku. Looking back, uh, we came here with the idea that we might look similar to Wisconsin and right to work. We're glad that uh, our friends in the Democratic Party and the Republican Party realized that uh, that type of policy change was not good for Minnesotans. It's a positive for everyone who's out there, this bonding bill. We needed it. It's good for the schools, for the capitals. It's, 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 we're headed in the right direction. Yeah.